Tonight, a longtime Arizona congressman is punished for breaking the rules on handling money for his campaign and in his Capitol Hill office. Republican David Schweikert was formally reprimanded by the House today. It's the first time this has happened to a member in eight years. Team 12's Bram Resnick breaks down what Schweikert did and whether voters might punish him for it. For three years, Congressman David Schweikert insisted this was just a bookkeeping mistake. A bipartisan ethics committee uncovered something else. Have you done anything wrong? No. That was Republican Congressman David Schweikert a year ago. Other than um, bookkeeping and mechanical, I think we're, we're, I think we're in good shape. But to the self-proclaimed math guy's colleagues, his story didn't add up. A transgression by one of us is a stain on all of us. The five-term congressman from Fountain Hills admitted to 11 ethics violations tied to his handling of campaign and office finances. He agreed to a $50,000 fine. In the matter of allegations relating to Representative David Swikert. And suffered a rare bipartisan reprimand by the entire House. The investigation was conducted thoroughly and without one hint of bias. According to the House Ethics Committee report, Schweikert improperly used taxpayer dollars and supporters' donations. His campaign booked phony loans and made phony payments. Some of Representative Schweikert's gravest violations arose from direct misconduct by him. Schweikert will likely face a well-funded Democrat in his Northeast Valley district in the November election. The congressman's campaign war chest depleted by about a million dollars in spending on legal bills. Uh, this is a very severe thing to happen to Schweikert, and I think it's going to play with some of these voters who are kind of sick of the corruption in D.C. A Schweikert spokeswoman issued this statement. We are pleased the committee has issued their report, and we can move forward from this chapter. In Phoenix, Bram Resnick, 12 News. Bram, thanks.